Hello everyone, my name is Patrika Minorsita. I recently achieved a Bachelor of Arts from German Studies Faculty of Humanities, Universitas Indonesia. I'd like to present a research from my final thesis, namely conceptual metaphors in German original soundtracks of anime and Second Titan. Anime refers to Japanese animation series or films. There are plenty of renowned anime such as Naruto, One Piece, Hunter x Hunter, and so on. Attack on Titan has also received lots of attention by anime fans because its uniqueness to use European elements, especially German, like its backgrounds that resembled Nordlingen in Germany, the story that inspired by World War II, including the fascism, and the characters' names such as Ernie Yeager, Mikasa Ackerman, Armin Arler, etc. It is set in a world where humanity lives inside cities that are surrounded by three enormous walls that protect them from Titans that it humans. The story follows Aaron Yeager, who vows to exterminate them after his hometown got destroyed, which brought his mother to death. Above all, the dumb songs for this anime mostly use German lyrics. The ones composed by Hiroyuki Sawano are Attack on Titan, Bob Kretze, Fogel and Kavik, UCB Girl City, and Zoe Sasima. The other two songs are Four Writer File on Bogan and The Frugal That Fly Hide by Ling Horizon. I noticed that the strong writers inserted metaphors to make the words and phrases on those lyrics more beautiful and intriguing. Metaphor is an implicit comparison between two dissimilar things such as life is a roller coaster, laughter is the music of the soul. At first, metaphor was considered as a figurative expression, but in 1980, Lakoff and Johnson published Metaphors We Live By, which said metaphor is pervasive in everyday life, not just in language but in thought and action. This starts the introduction of conceptual metaphors. For example, time is money. In daily conversation, we may be familiar with phrases, I don't have time for you, or you are wasting my time. Time is being compared with money because they have similarity, which is precious and don't want to be wasted. This phrase is conceptual metaphor because they equate two concept areas. The source domain is the concept area from which the metaphor is drawn, money. Target domain is the concept area to which the metaphor is applied, time. Conceptual metaphors sees the connections between concepts arise in terms of correspondences or mappings between elements within source and target domains. At the beginning, Lakoff and Jensen divided conceptual metaphors into three forms, structural, ontological, and orientational. Structural metaphor is a case where a concept is arranged metaphorically with other concepts or terms. This source domain provides the framework for the target domain. It is what determines the ways in which human thinks and talk about the entities and activities that the target domain refers to. Ontological metaphors allow us to conceptualize and talk about things, experiences, and processes, no matter how vague and abstract they may be, as if they had a physical form. In other words, the ontological metaphor makes something abstract a concrete noun. Classical metaphors view it as personifications. Orientational metaphor involves the orientation or spatial concept of a thing, such as up, down, and inside out, as in the concept of happy is up, sad is down, and more is up, less is down. Nolus and Moon stated that there is an overlap between the three. Structural and orientational can also have the function of ontological, while ontological depend on what is structured from the source domain. This statement is based on lack of enchantment in 2003, who referred to the artificial categorization, arguing that all conceptual metaphors are structural and ontological, also many are orientational. This revised theory, which was written in the second edition of Metaphors We Live By that was published in 2003, is the basis of this research question. From the seven songs, I see that there are several conceptualizations in the lyrics which are interesting to study. I want to see whether the conceptual metaphors found in the lyrics can prove that conceptual metaphors are structural and ontological metaphors. The method used in the study is the qualitative descriptive. It intends to understand the object, but not to make generalizations, but to extrapolate the meaning behind the object. I was understanding the meaning behind each life values and beliefs, social situations, events, and phenomena written in the songs with my own perception. Through my research, I found eight big concepts of conceptual metaphors from seven original soundtracks that use German lyrics of anime Attack on Titan. There are life, hope, heaven, death, destiny, hatred, victory, and freedom. They were then divided again into 14 mappings. From the concept of life, I got 5 mappings. Life is nature, life is light, life is wings, life is treasure, life is journey. From the lyrics, Die grandiose nature zorg immer nog für ihre Kinder, I conclude that nature becomes life for the creatures in it, such as plains and waters. All natural resources become life for all living things. Because nature is not ontological, this form of metaphor is structural. Without life, there will be no life. The light in the lyrics is so is as igma, unser Licht ist nur das trinkt und singen wir begrüßen morgen. Describe the human life which is filled with pleasure by drinking and singing until tomorrow comes. This type of metaphor is structural and ontological, because human can't see light.
The survey corps in this anime has the task of going outside the walls and doing research on titans. On their uniforms, there's a pair of wings as a symbol of freedom. And the context from lyrics, Will Fenton can find this desert heights of wind to serve frugal named. Humans want to keep fighting until their wings are crushed by the wind. That is, humans will not give up until the, their lives run out. The concept of metaphor that is from is structural. Life is analogous to treasure which the owner must take good care of it. Every human being's life can only be taken by God. That's why in the lyric, Niemann Dorf Eigen Zinich Zainas Lebens Verden, humans are furious because their free life was snatched away by titans. This metaphorical conceptualization of life is structural and ontological. Linker weg, rechter weg. Now, I'm fair for sure is. Everyone must have been lost and felt confused to choose a path. The same with life, there are many choices that can end in both good and bad. This lyric describes the character of Aaron Diego when he has to choose his steps to uncover the secret of the beginning of the Titan's appearance, but has to give up the lives of his comrades. This form of conceptual metaphor is structural and ontological. From the concept of hope, I got one mapping. Hope is horizon. In the anime, the characters are curious about what lies beyond the ocean, beyond the horizon, because they are always inside the walls. They hope for a better life. To explain the concept of hope, the horizon source domain is used because they are invisible and become the point to be reached or achieved. So metaphor conceptual metaphors in the lyric was finden wir jenseits dieses horizontes is structural because the horizon is visible. From the concept of heaven, I got one mapping. Heaven is twilight. According to Christian beliefs, the sky is the place where the angels live. In the anime, the elite who live inside the walls are very religious, so they also believe what the three goddesses say. Understanding the concept of heaven in lyric is thus the angle that formed the more than human under folk. With twilight makes this conceptual metaphor not ontological, but still structural. From the concept of death, I got two mappings. Death is afterglow and death is entity. Abend wrote, which means the afterglow or sunset is interpreted as death because what awaits after the red sky is the dark sky. And the lyric, an jenem tag, where as ein sehr feuriges Abend wrote, ich versteckte die Biografie vor dir, traurige Erinnerung an meine Kindheit. There is an implication that the character is enjoying the reddish sky when the disaster strikes, namely when the titan attacks and causes traumatic childhood memories. The conceptual metaphor that is formed is structural. Sterben in the lyric, alles leben die gestirb eines Tages, Ob wir zum Sterben bereit sind oder nicht, der Tag kommt sicher, which means death will be experienced by every living being and the day will surely come. Death becomes an entity that will pick us up when our time on earth has runs out. Entities are used as personifications. Conceptual metaphors like this are structural and ontological. From the concept of destiny, I got one mapping. Destiny is entity. In the lyric, wir werden gegen unser Schicksal ankämpfen, wir dürfen uns nicht in unser Schicksal ergeben. The destiny that humans feel is not beautiful, so they have to fight it, like an enemy that must be slaughtered. Ontological metaphors are formed here because they conceptualize abstract elements, and they are also structural. From the concept of hatred, I got two mappings, hatred is spirit and hatred is double-edged blade. Hatred is a human trait that has characteristics with fire, which is blazing and smoldering. The lyric, mit der Blut des Hasses schwenken wir die based on spirit to do something that usually ends in destruction. With hatred initially felt for revenge, Eden Yeager destroys everything because he cannot control his sword swing and power. These conceptual metaphors forms are structural and ontological. Klinge or double H arrive in the lyric Der Junge von eins wird bald das schwarze Schwert ergreifen Has und Zorn sein eine zwei schändige Klinge Can be used to describe hatred and anger Similar to hatred, a person struggles against destroying his life But on the one hand, hatred can destroy life because it loses its direction This type of metaphor is structural From the concept of victory, I got one mapping Victory is party a party is filled with fun and celebration activities. This concept can describe something as abstract as victory from the lyrics Oh man, from fire and weird is in Zeke, fear the next and come. The victory gained from fighting the titans with a great struggle. They felt it was worth celebrating and taking a short break and having fun before the next storm. This concept of metaphors form are structural. From the concept of freedom, I got one mapping. Freedom is death. The meaning of the sentence, die Freiheit und der Tod die Weiden sind Zwillinge, shows that to achieve freedom, humans must sacrifice many lives or die. Death is also a form of freedom where humans no longer need to struggle. This is a structural and ontological metaphor. Of the seven songs, 17 datas were found containing conceptual metaphors, which were divided into eight major concepts. From 14 mappings, I find the same quantity of structural, ontological, and structural metaphors only. This proves the theory of Lakoff and Johnson in 2003 that all conceptual metaphors are structural. The ontological conceptual metaphor must be structural, but the structural form is not necessarily ontological. In mappings taken from 17 datas, 7 datas are structural only and 7 datas 
or structural and ontological. There is no orientational concept of metaphor because there is no special element in the source domain. All metaphors are structural because they compare the target domain and the source domain. Metaphors whose sources are abstract are said to be ontological, but nature is said to be ontological because the risk of the song contain personification.